What is going on guys? Welcome to Greggles TV. I'm going to walk you through how to sideload an app on your new Google Chromecast with Google TV. This will allow you to install apps that aren't necessarily in the store that you find right here. So maybe you have like an IPTV service you subscribe to or some other app that's just not in there. This is going to allow you to do that. So let's walk through that. So the first thing that you want to do is you want to go to the very top of your screen, go all the way over to the right where your picture is and select that. Next, what you want to do is go down and click on settings. Go down, see system and select that. Click about. And then you're, what you're gonna do is go down until you see Android TV OS build. And you're gonna click on that about seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six. It's gonna say you're one step away from being a developer. Press that a last time. It'll now say that you're a developer. You need this obviously to happen. Go back to your home screen. Once you're back at the home screen, go over to apps. And there's multiple apps that you could use, but the one I like is called Downloader. Um, you could use, uh, again, there's other apps you could do. So just look for, search for apps down here under apps and search for Downloader. And then hit the little search icon towards the bottom right. Click install. And just wanna let this download and install. Now that it's downloaded, what you wanna do is hit your home button again on your remote, go all the way to the top, go back to your picture, tap on that, go to settings, click on apps this time, tap on security and restrictions, click on unknown sources, and where it says download or click on that so that it's now allowed to install unknown apps. And then at that point, hit your home button one more time and just go down until you see uh, the downloader app, It'll probably be all the way over to the right, tap on that, hit allow, hit okay. And this is where you can download any app that you want to install on your TV that's compatible with your TV. You just put the web address in here and hit go. You can also install a, a browser add-on. You'll see when you click browser right here, it tells you to just type in browser.aftnews.com in the URL field on the home. So I'll show you that just to give you an example. So browser.aftvnews.com. And then you see once you type that, just hit go, it'll download. And then you just hit install. And that's how pretty much you would download any app. You can hit done at this point, done again. And now when I go to browser, I'll be able to download to browse like a website or something just by going to the top here and typing in any address that I want. Otherwise, again, if you just want to download and install any other app, just go to home here on the left-hand side and then type in the URL for the app that you want to download. And again, when you type in the address that you want, this is, I'll just run through it real quick. If you didn't want like the browser add on, type in the address uh, of the uh, exact file where it is that you want to download. Maybe it's on Cody's website or something like that. Type it in. And then once you're done typing it in, hit this arrow on the keyboard and it should connect and automatically start downloading the file. And then once it's done downloading, it'll ask you to install it. So hit install. And then once it's done being installed, you can either hit done or open. We'll just hit done just to be showing you where it goes and then hit your home button on your remote. And then what you wanna do is you can go into uh, the app. You'll see it will be one of your last apps. And if you wanna move it, just press and hold it. And then you can hit move and just move it to wherever you want to put that app. When you're done, just hit select again and it'll be done. You can also delete the downloaded file. So just go back into downloader and you'll see, you could see delete right here, but where you'll also see it is if you go into uh, files on the left and you'll see the file wherever both files or one of the files, press and hold the select button and then you'll see delete. And again, just press and hold it and then select delete. And that's it, that's how you delete your files and that's how you install apps that are not in the Google Play Store. Hopefully that was easy to follow. Thanks for watching, see you guys down the road.